So if there's any evidence that we are not living in a random universe that's completely pointless, and you can get there rationally without having to dive into religion, that would help everyone because it would change the way that we behave. In a nihilistic universe, the winner is the one who ends up with the most toys. And that's it. Like, that's the end of that story. There's nothing else there. So in that case, even virtue is not its own reward. There's no reward in this. So if it turns out, though, that we live in a universe that is purposeful or even one where consciousness plays an active role or anything like that, that's a very different story that we start telling. Yeah. And that's not just theory. I mean, there are plenty of people who have matured to a great degree spiritually who never for a second you know, regard the universe as nihilistic or accidental or meaningless or anything else. Their whole life is just overflowing with, with meaning and significance and fulfillment all the time. Right. And that's, that's the hope for every human being. Yeah. That's like the, the essence of every mystical experience. The person comes back and tries to express the, in, in the, the ineffable in millions of words. <laughs> you can't do it. <laughs> yeah. But it, that's the same story again. You get a sense that the universe is a living thing that does have purpose and meaning. And we are tiny, tiny little reflection of that, except that we can be hypnotized into thinking that we're just machines made out of meat. Yeah, 